Hello viewers, welcome to my channel PMC. In this video, we are going to learn a new concept, forward subtraction in class 1. Subtraction is one of the mathematical operations on numbers. Before knowing forward subtraction, let us quickly revise what is backward subtraction. How do you subtract 4 minus 2? In our usual method of subtraction or the backward subtraction, we keep 4 in the mind and 2 in the fingers. And subtraction means we will always deal with the before numbers. Before 4, 3, 2. Let us look at another example. 9 minus 5. 9 in the mind, 5 in the fingers. Before 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4. So this is the usual way that we do subtraction. Now let us see what is for forward subtraction with the help of examples. Let us take the same example of 4 minus 2. In forward subtraction, we will be seeing what are the numbers or how many numbers you need to reach from 2 to 4. Let us see that now. To travel from 2 to 4, we need 3, 4. So how many numbers we need? 1, 2. So the difference between 4 minus 2 is equal to 2 which means that we have to travel 2 numbers in the forward direction to reach from 2 to 4. Let us do more examples to understand this concept better. Let us take the example of 11 minus 5. So in the forward subtraction method let us see what are the numbers that you need to reach 11 from 5. So, to travel from 5 to 11, we need 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So, how many numbers do we need? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, the answer is 6. That is, you have to travel 6 numbers in the forward direction to reach 11. Hope you understood what do you mean by forward subtraction? In general, in subtraction, we deal with before numbers. That is, for 11 minus 5, we would have done before 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. You get the same answer. But in forward direction, we are traveling from 5 to 11, for which we need 6 numbers. Let us do more examples now. 19 minus 10. So, in forward subtraction, to reach from 10 to 19, we need 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. So what are the numbers that you need? Or what are the total number of numbers that you need? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So the answer is 9. So you need 9 numbers to reach from 10 to 19. So, the subtraction of 19 minus 10 will give you 9. Let us do the example 25 minus 18. So, in forward subtraction, to reach 25 from 18, we have to traverse through 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. That is, we need 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. We need 7 numbers to reach 25 from 18. So the difference between 25 minus 18 is 7. Let us take the example of 35 minus 27. Let us do forward subtraction now. So after 27 it is 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. So you need 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 numbers to reach 35 from 27. So the subtraction of 35 minus 27 will give you 8. Let us take the example of 43 minus 38. In forward subtraction, we need 39, 40, 41, 42, 43. To reach from 38 to 43. So how many numbers? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So the answer is 
5. 43 minus 38 will give you the answer 5. Let us do one more example. 66 minus 57. In forward subtraction, what do you do? To reach from 57 to 66, we need 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66. How many numbers you need? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So you need 9 numbers to travel from 57 to 66. That is the difference between 66 and 57 is 9. Dear viewers, hope you understood how to do subtraction in the forward direction in class 1. These are all the learning outcome in class 1 under the topic subtraction of which I have covered the topic single digit subtraction with objects, properties of subtraction, horizontal and vertical subtraction by counting backward, subtraction using number line in separate videos. Links to all those videos are given below in the description box and also in the iCard section. In this video, we learnt how to do subtraction by counting forward. In my upcoming videos, I will be dealing with the topics subtraction of two digit numbers without regrouping, story sums and subtraction worksheet. All these topics will be dealt with in separate videos. Links to all the related videos will be given below in the description box. You may also click on the in-screen video to take you directly to the playlist containing class 1 subtraction videos. Thank you for watching my video. See you in the next video with the next topic on subtraction. If you like my video, give a thumbs up and do subscribe to my channel and do not forget to click on the bell button to get regular notifications of all the new videos that I make in my channel. See you again.